So guys, I'm out here for the Heineken Rather Leave Your Music, but of course brought to you by Heineken. And I've got the man of the night and the entire weekend. How are you, Jidana? Man, I'm great. Yo. I, I just got here today, so I'm... I'm yeah, I can imagine. It's okay. Like, jet lag doesn't... It, it doesn't phase me. Okay, so great. So already I know that we're anticipating something great for the entire weekend. But then again, you know, each time you come to Nigeria, there's there's a lot that a lot of people have to say or ask about. But then I felt like musically, you've already explained all of those things I inspire you. But what keeps you going? Because it's a difficult thing to always have a show or like have a hit song or have a new look that's always refreshing. What actually keeps you going? I want people on the African continent and the African diaspora to move like one unit. That's my only purpose in this life, uh, honestly. Like I know it for sure. I'm not doing, everybody else has all, all these other reasons, um, but that's my singular reason. So when I wake up in the morning, that's what I think about. When I look out across Lagos, that's what I'm thinking about. Like how can we uh, enhance our, our life and our standard of living, enhance the beauty on this continent that already exists. That's all I care about, honestly. So that's why I'm. That's why I wake up every day. That's why I come here so often, honestly. I I, I can actually relate to that. <laughs> now I know that musically, you always like to put in your own style. Even your hair, your look, the swag is very different. It's it's a blend of different, you know. It's a blend of a lot of things. But then, what what are what are those other things that you might want to double into if it's not just music? Uh, not just music. I mean. Of course, I'm here for uh, Heineken, but also Fashion Week. So I would like to eventually uh, either style or create a collection. I'm not sure. It depends. It depends. I know people have been asking for like two years now, but I, uh, I'm slow to, to move on that because a lot of people fail in the fashion industry. So for me, I'm a student first before I try to be a teacher. I'm, just, I'm learning. I'm honestly learning. That's number one. Two, uh, I started in some TV series last year, so I hope to, to move into TV shows. I was on Insecure and uh, Luke Cage on Netflix and, and HBO, so I'm moving from those, I mean, both Hollywood, Nollywood, everything. Um, other than that, than that, man, I want to talk to the African Union directly and, and the UN. And I have some ideas that I think uh, might change some things around here. So it's honestly anything that I could do from economics to the education, schooling. I started a scholarship um, at my, my dad's former university. Yeah, and uh, when I went to Enugu uh, last year. So any anything that I can dibble and dabble in, I'll, I'll be in. So then we know that um, the event is this weekend and you're here for all of that. When you first heard about the Leave Your Music, I mean, the concept of it, and the fact that, like you said earlier, I remember, I actually recall our folks drinking a lot of Star and Heineken and, and Guinness and all of that, yeah. So how did that, like, because I know that each show, you probably have, like, an idea or a perception or how you want to go around it, but then when you heard about the Heineken Leave Your Music, the concept and everything put together with the Nigerian Fashion Week, what came well, I think that the the phrase "live your music" means that your 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 music should be your lifestyle. Um, like right now, Wizkid is playing. I saw him maybe two or three months ago, and we we're chilling in LA. And he he lives. He actually cares that people just live and and have enjoyment. And he lives that. He's a cool, like one of the coolest guys, man. But all the homies from Tiwa to Burna, Burna Boy is like my ace, man. Um, these people, they live like, like somebody like Burna, for example. He's, his, he, his reputation, you know, I think it's, it's inflated a little bit. Like people think he's wild, like, but I, I'll say that he lives his music. So for me, it's just that your lifestyle matches your music. And all these artists I mentioned, they have that.